So, we have a problem. We can't connect to the internet, because the wireless adapter is not available here, where it should be. Let's solve this problem very easily and quickly. Connect the data cable, to the laptop. It must appear here, as you can see now. On the phone, we are looking for the USB tethering option. It should be here in the settings, at portable hotspot. But if you want, you can search for it directly. If this option does not appear available, as it is here, then the cable is not properly connected. Try another USB port, or even another data cable. Ok, if the cable is good, it will appear something like this. Choose no data transfer. Now the USB tethering can be activated. Network message will appear on the laptop. We can choose which option we want. Now we have internet on the laptop. We have two options, one would be to let it update automatically. Or we can search for new updates. After a while, you can check to see if the wireless networks are available. If yes, then you can remove the cable, and connect to your wireless. I removed the data cable, it should change to wireless, and yes, he did change. The wireless icon appeared and everything works normally. But, I can't help thinking, that everything might not go according to plan, and the wireless network might not appear, yes? If this happened, then you must follow these steps. Go to settings, then windows update. Here, search for updates, and if it shows us that everything is updated, we will choose view optional updates. Here, we will choose driver updates, and we'll select all the drivers, or, as the case may be, only the driver, that has connections with the wireless, and in that way, the problem will be solved. However, there could be another problem. Check if the airplane mode button, is not pressed. If so, then this is where the problem was, and it will be solved if we disable it. Another problem that can be is, maybe, you accidentally pressed the button that turn on, or off, the wireless. Look at the top of the keyboard, where the F buttons are, and if, you have a wireless button, press it once, then wait 120 seconds to see if it appears. If it does not appear, press once again, and wait another 120 seconds. If it still doesn't appear, and you've done everything I taught you, we have the last option. We have to check in the BIOS to see if the wireless is activated or not. To enter the BIOS, we must restart the laptop, and when is starting, continuously press the F2 or F1 button, or both, until the BIOS menu appears. Here, we have to look, in the configuration menu, and choose wireless LAN, and activate it, even if it is activated. Now we save the changes, and take it from scratch with the data cable. It is very possible that it will work. If not, then I think the wireless module is defective. I wish you success. If this video helped you, then please like, and subscribe. Bye.